I don't have to explain myself to anybody and I ain't gonna really bother. Now, I was asked here, right, to interview with the band here, Pill, but now, like, we're facing a cheapskate comedy interrogation act and it just ain't on, pal. It's a joke. It's a farce. You mean you don't want to give any messages to I don't to have the... to explain myself. Sooner or later, somebody will open their eyes. Oh, sorry, rude word. Well, it sounds like we've heard this story before. Really? Um, Would you like to tell me where? Good night. Good night. Will I continue? Well, that's up to you entirely. Uh, do you all follow the leader? Yeah, you ain't no leader. Well, no. all right. I thought well, that, I thought that was the point of having four people. You small... asked just me and him, didn't you, to do All right, an come on, you, the rest know? of the band. Oh, why don't you try to answer an intelligent question? Try and think of one. I'll tell you if what. you've ever asked one in your life. Let's forget about it all. Right. Yeah, I think you oh, should. No, 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 that's just total cop-out. Cop-out. Call an interview. I mean, what has happened to the pop stars of today? I mean, everyone who comes up to the tube, nice as they are, is so polite and handshakeable. They're like double glazing representatives at a sales conference. Where has the anarchy gone in music? That's what I want to know. And apparently, lots of it, yes, exactly. Here, here, it's like a house of commons here. A lot of people want to know that because everyone's getting very nostalgic these days because 1986 is obviously the 10th anniversary of when the Sex Pistols first made a big movement into the popular movement, popular music industry, I should say. Would you like to read this? I think you'd probably do a better job. So he's on the cover, John, uh, Johnny Rotten, from everything, from about the music press to the Lancet and Homes and Gardens. So you might be wondering where the rest of the band have got to. Well, we know where Sid Vicious has got to, unfortunately, but where has Steve Jones got to? Well, we know. Because when we were out in Los Angeles filming the film which you saw with Malcolm McLaren, we discovered him playing with a band called the Dano Jones Band, which we're assured is just a band with a whole lot of friends, but I don't think he liked us actually filming this, and you'll see why. Too much and beat me your kid. Well, I don't know where to run. I don't know what to do. It seems like they're everywhere. Even my ex-wife's in too. Oh, my shirt's even torn. I feel like General Custer. A little bit. Take the queen. She ain't 
depressed. You think, oh, well, nothing much has happened in the last 10 years since that. Well, don't get too depressed, because everybody is saying that the next big thing is going to be Zig Zig Sputnik. Mind you, the people who are saying that are all in Zig Zig Sputnik. But there's no doubt at all that young Tony James and his band of people with incredibly limited musical ability are certainly going to do something, even if it's only to get a Satchi and Satchi Award for hype. Because what they've given us is not a promo video, it's a promo video of their promo video. Do you understand that? Probably not. But this is to promo the video which they're apparently going to bring up with them when they come up next week, because we're hoping to have young Tony and very handsome Martin here to explain themselves. So watch this and try and understand it. From the nighttime neon city wastelands of the 80s music scene, there was to come a group who would take the fifth step into the future of rock and roll. Are you a group whose principal interests are TV, Star Wars, all we need is design our violence. Home computers, high tech sex. But are they going to cause us any trouble? The ultra vixens. Adrenaline. Is it true? Excitement. Is it you mean they're going to make a record? Get ready for the fifth generation of rock and roll. Hi, I'm the big rapper. I was in London, England a few days ago.